the cup games are all over now, Peter. Are you happy with how the team performed against some tough opposition? Yeah, I was happy in stages, but obviously unpleased um, with a, with a few of the situations. But that was that's that's what the Betfred's all about for us, really. Um, it's an extension of our pre-season and the new team that we've got. There was there was a lot of um, problems thrown up for them to try and deal with, and some of them they didn't deal with. So that what gives us a chance then on the, the training field to work with that and and get them to know what we want as a as a coaching staff and all that. So it was. It's a good exercise for us to Beth Red and I think like I said earlier on in the week since the group stages have been uh, introduced uh, with the Beth Red Cup there's no League 2 side has gone through uh, to the knockout stage um, I think that's a fact so uh, realistically it is an extension of our pre-season so some good things some bad things some you know conceding four and five goals is something that we don't want to do every week but we're playing against very good opposition um, albeit the Motherwell game we were 2-0 up to the last 10 minutes. We had our best period of the game and I start trying to put more men forward. So the, the extra two goals in that game, I, that's my responsibility. You know, it's not the players. So I think if we came off 2-0, it's a very good, you know, from someone looking in, go, oh, they're doing quite well there, but we still lost a game 2-0. So we need to change them around a little bit. But coming into the season, we're looking forward to that start and uh, see how we go. Yeah, the league opener on Saturday, but Rican, it's... Uh tough away journey do we know what to expect from Brecon? Yeah, we do got a little little bit of homework not a lot uh, done on Brecon I suppose most teams at this stage of the season are a little bit of an unknown until you get into the season and you learn more about the teams and how they set up um, people are saying it's a hard one away from home you know a big long trip but for us it's probably a good thing to get it out of the way uh, we're looking forward to the start of it you know it seems like a long time pre-season but it's really been short short pre-season after the playoffs last year so I think the players are just looking forward to getting into it um, and we'll see where we go from there Is there any areas you're still looking to strengthen before the window closes? Well the window is different for us um, with the loan windows and everything like that because we get an extension for an extra month till the end of September so we're not in any immediate rush I think for us it'll be get into the season start, start of the season see if we need to strengthen and where we need to strengthen um, I still want to bring in maybe one or two but I shouldn't think there'll be loads coming in we always have a small squad uh, because that's the market we're in um, so yeah we'll just see how we start and, and what we need to do